Yo! Hello, good morning, welcome back to the vlog. Holly and I are currently working away on our Monday watching some Goodwill hunting. I haven't seen this movie in ages and it looks very good. Um, but we've got some Amazon packages just turned up, so we're gonna open those! I don't know what's in these completely. Have some guesses. Holly, what do you think this one is? I've forgotten what we've ordered. Oh no. Ear tags. An ear tag okay. and a small rig connection thing. And what do you think's in this one? Um, not your headphones, that's a small Your frame for your phone, I mean for your camera. Correct! We've got some small rig kit for my new camera. Um, been needing this for a while. And it's going to be a game changer. So, very exciting little unboxing to start off the day. And Holly got all the guesses right. So, good job. How beautiful! is this a fully rigged fully caged out sony zve one i it's been a minute i've had this camera for a while and i haven't been able to put a cage on it or have the monitor on it or anything but oh boy this feels good now for some reason like it obviously doesn't change the quality of the camera itself changes your ability to use it but also just looks so much more professional like if you rock up to a shoot with this versus with just a little small camera everybody instantly thinks you're better what you do even even if you're not all the gear no idea effect to a t exactly that but i, I also like it because it looks sick and is very handy for using it so i've kind of contradicted myself there but i cooked up a little storm and made some fajitas um, so we're having a dinner, we're going to sit down and watch some movie, we don't know what yet. Um, yeah, anything to add? Oh, it just looks amazing. Tom, Tom did me a solid and was Master Chef, so I'm stoked. Just the usual around these parts. Yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to work out how to sign the vlog out for the day and add a bit more substance uh, to you guys. Because again, I've been poor, I'm sorry, but we're getting to the end. But I'm going to sign off by saying like kit out your camera like small rig uh camera equipment for all the cages and stuff it's such high quality i absolutely love it and they have some touches which make them next level let me show you i think this right here is probably potentially my favorite part about the cage itself because obviously you need allen keys you need bits and pieces and like when you're mounting um a tripod base always need something look at what right here the key exactly what you need and even better like it's not going to fall off it's mag magnetic it's magnetized in there it's going to stay it's going to stick so that is pretty sick i'm a big big fan of that because it most makes it more applicable i do need to get one of the tripods that lock into um oh what's it called c plate i can't remember what it's called but this specific plate here because my tripod doesn't but i love the fact that i can now rock around with this because having an LCD screen that big to see what you've got in focus and what you're looking at makes a massive difference. It does look a little bit weird being that far away because I normally film everything um, in portrait. It's a long way away to be looking from there to there but actually hold up. Just remembered I have this mounting piece right here which hopefully um, if I mount that then to there that is a lot better in terms of accessibility in relation to the actual screen. Still sticking quite far out. I might have a, more of a play around with this, but this is the luxury. Um, you can muck around with this sort of stuff as much as you want because you have the ability to. Um, so I've just successfully rambled on for about a minute about smaller cages. And I might title this like the number one accessory you need for your camera. Um... And yeah, that's the video done. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I shall see you tomorrow.